Um, hi, we're SMART, SMART Ads for Smart Cities. My name is Alberto Lian and I'm 18 years old and I'm from Murcia, Spain. My name is Braulio Valdivielso and I'm a web developer from, from Malaga. My name is Jorge Izquierdo and uh, we've been working all together in SMART and it's been quite awesome winning the, the, first, the first award of the, of the hackathon, we didn't expect it at all and we also were awarded the, the best young developer prize. My name is Alejandro, I am a 17 years old backend developer. So what's Matt? Uh, what we've been working on the last two days is, well, like I said, smart ads. What are smart ads? Well these are ads that are depends on different uh, conditions. We've been using a sensor which is, has a proximity sensor, a temperature sensor, a humidity sensor and and also luminity sensor. So with that, we can show the user the ad that they want in that specific moment. For example, if it's a sunny day, they might see a sunglasses app or maybe even a bikini app so, so they can go to the pool. And if it's rainy, maybe they can they find a, a, an umbrella ad or a coat ad if it's cold. And also thanks to this, advertisers can show ads that are similar to the context in which the user is living. For example, if the user is in the beach, maybe the ad is in also in the beach, so that uh, the user uh, feels uh, identified with the ad that he's watching. And also, thank, uh, we can also add uh, a lot of other stuff, like big data, so the ads are even more specific about the user's needs, and they can also interact with smartphones. Thanks to that, uh, the ad can even be even more personal with the user that's going past the, the screens in which the ads are, are displayed. About the firewall, firewall technology, uh, I have been working with Wirecloud the, and it has been the front end in which the advertisers uh, could have managed their ads and managed the conditions in which their ads are displayed. Uh, I can say that uh, while I'm sure that it, it is going to improve a lot during the following months. Uh, I, I can say that uh, it has been useful for having the having the layout to manage all these ads and having everything connected in the firewall 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 environment. Well I've been working with the IoT stuff, the Internet of Things and I have to say that it has been extremely easy work to work with it. Uh, it's just, it's not, it's like plug and play. You put it, you put the sensors in, and we also are really thankful for to the to the Fireware team to, that has provided us a bunch of sensors to do a lot of tests and uh, some Raspberry Pis to <coughs> to do the the deployment. I have been working, as I said before, uh, with the backend stuff. I was do, uh, doing uh, the algorithms to distribute the advertisement uh, and I was communicating with the hardware, uh, the client for creating ads and also uh, the client for showing the ads in a TV. Uh, and that's all. Smart ads for smart cities. And now I'm very glad to give the most important prize of the Fiverr Hackathon. Um, and this is a prize that is based not on the only on the technical relevance about uh, being able to use Fiverr technologies, but also the potential of the application itself, which I have to remember that has to be has been developed in just two days, is for the. Uh, Smart Ops project by Alberto Elias Tito.